Thanks, guys. So, yes, I'm hanging out with the CEO of United Way Northeast Florida, Michelle Braun. And I have to say, it's not very often you see a CEO putting in work and getting their hands dirty. But you got your gloves on. You're dusty. So... Thanks for hanging out with us for a little bit today. Thanks for being here. And my fellow uh, nonprofit partner CEOs would say that, yeah, they're used to getting their hands dirty. So we're proud to be here. Well, you guys are actually doing a lot for the community around here. Right now, you can see some of the volunteers. They are doing a lot on this house. And I asked earlier, like, what has the improvement been like since you started? And the word is amazing. It's been awesome to be out here on the east side with our partners, and this is United Way's Day of Action. So across the country, different United Ways in the summer get together. And here locally, we're trying to promote this east side neighborhood. They're amazing. And on Saturday, it's Juneteenth, so we're really proud to be here um, helping lift up this community. Now, when it comes to United Way, there you guys are always doing things, but how important is it and how does it make you feel that you're out here doing this, giving back to the community in such a hands-on way? We're so proud to be here and our volunteers, it really helps everybody get an understanding of the important work that's going on and get to know our neighbors and really celebrate together. And this is part of the historic East Side CDC's Front Porch Project. So we're redoing the front porch of some senior homes today. And we were talking earlier about the volunteers and these guys are out. I was like, they're putting in a lot of work and they're sweating in this heat, but they are loving what they do. What is it about it that you attracts them to this opportunity? I think it's a chance to really, especially this is our first time together since the pandemic, being able to do a hands-on project. So getting out and really we missed being together and doing um, work together to improve our community. Well, with that, you're always looking for volunteers. So would you like to make your pitch like, hey, come out and join us? We'd love to. We'd love to. Anyone who's interested in volunteering, you can go to our website, unitedwaynefl.org, unitedwaynefl.org. And there's a list of volunteer projects for many different partners. You can sign up to do projects like this or help individual nonprofits. And so it's not always about giving back in this way. There's other ways people can contribute. Can you give me a list of some, just a few? Well, we'd love, of course, any financial donations make this word possible and your gift of time and also getting involved in advocacy on different issues. And the smiles you see on like the homeowners faces when when you, you first show up, I'm sure they're like, yay. But when it's done, the homeowner here has lived here for more than 60 years. Pastor Harry, who's working on this house, you know, grew up down the road and, and knew Mr. Caesar before. Um, well, Mr. Caesar knew him before he was born. So it's really a great community effort. And we, we'd also like to ask viewers to come out on Saturday to the Melanin Market. Mm -hmm. And it's the largest outdoor black market here locally. There's 200 plus vendors and it's amazing. Well, like I say, people, support your locals, support good causes. This is definitely one of the best. So thank you for hanging out with us today and for what you guys are doing down the neighborhood. Thank you all for sharing the positive story. We try our best. We're going to be coming back in just a little bit. We're going to meet up with the oldest married couple in this neighborhood just to kind of get their vibe as their house is being improved as well. So you guys hang with us for that. Let's check back in with Mark and Eden. Well, we know that there is no shortage of you watching that wants to help too. So PositivelyJax.com is where you can go to learn more about ways that you can make an impact in this community. Not only that, when you become a News for Jax insider, we make sure that you're always apprised of these projects as well. But head on over to Positively Jax. We would love to get you to sign up today. And once you've signed up, you will be reminded anytime there is a project like this where we can use volunteers. And whether you want to volunteer because it just makes your, your heart happy or you have a situation where you're looking for volunteer hours. The summer is here. A lot of kids are needing some volunteer hours. Head on over today you'll get a chance to see some of the other wonderful things that are happening in our community and we're just so proud to be a part of it absolutely you could also nominate someone as well so again positivelyjacks.com to get involved also the insider it's a great resource to be connected to our organization 